Hi everybody, it's Joelle again, and I'm here to learn about a new sport. It's also in the Olympics, but it's also in the NRV, and I have a friend here with me to tell me all about it. Ladies and gentlemen, it's Evie! Yeah! Evie, how old are you? I am 14 years old. 14 years old, and I don't know if you've noticed this, friends, but Evie, Evie knows a lot. She knows a lot about Taekwondo, and we're gonna learn from Evie about Taekwondo. So, what is Taekwondo? Taekwondo is a form of martial arts where we do something called a form, which is just like a bunch of cool, crazy moves all in one. Whoa. And then we do sparring, which is when we have a bunch of gear on and we can kick and punch each other. Whoa! Okay, and we're not gonna spar today because no. out Chihuahua, she would, she, she could take me on. Okay. How long have you been doing Taekwondo? I have been doing Taekwondo since I was seven, so I've been doing it for seven years. Seven years, and now I see you're wearing a really cool outfit. We just call this our uniform. Uniform, okay. Um, and normally I also would not wear tennis shoes with it, but since we're outside. And it's cold today, it's people. Cold. It's cold. <laughs> and then, so I have my belt. Yes. And then I have here. I have my the Taekwondo like America, which is the, oh, the yeah. organization. And then I have my school patch right here, so when you, I go... you go to... Franklin Taekwondo. And that's in Christiansburg, right? Behind the courthouse. Behind the courthouse. This yeah. is for when I go to like events, like national events, they know where I'm from. And then on my back, <gasps> I have my name and where I'm from. Your name and where you're from. Uh -huh. So so they know while you're sparring or what have you, exactly where you are. And when you get you your are. black belt, you put uh -huh. your name on the back of your uniform. Oh, cool. Okay, wait a minute. She just told us something. When you get your black belt, you get your name on the back of the uniform. So that means, that means you have a black belt. Yes, I do. And it, so wait, there's two stripes on your. Yes, yeah, so this means I'm a second degree senior black belt when I have two stripes. And there are nine levels of black belt, so I still have a long time to go. Wow, but time. you're on your second one. Yeah. That's and amazing. So, and the last thing is this thing right here. Mm -hmm. It means that I'm a level two instructor, which means I can teach people. Which is exactly what she's going to do with me here today. I've only done, I've done some kickboxing before. Just FYI, if you are watching this and you want to try this, make sure you do it in a safe way. These are beginner steps. They are not meant for you to try on anyone else. So if you're really interested in Taekwondo, make sure you set yourself up with an awesome class so you're on point with what you need to do to keep you and others safe. But I have never, I have never done Taekwondo. I'm so excited. So, what is the first thing that you're gonna teach? The first thing you always learn when you take your first class is how to form a fist. A fist, so, okay. So we're gonna start with our hands out in front of us. And you can follow along, friends. Yes, and we're gonna curl our fingers, and then we're gonna stick our thumbs on the outside. Because if we stuck our thumbs on the inside, if I went to go punch something, I would break my thumb. And I don't Ow. think anybody wants no. to break their thumbs. No, thank you. So, when we do a punch, we start back at our hips where your belt would be. Okay. And then, and we start with our palms up facing the sky. Okay. So we can get a good wrist rotation when we punch. And so we looks, switch. Yes. Whoa. So you basically just switch, switch. Switch, 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 switch. <laughs> oh wow, what am I doing with my feet at that point? Okay, so now we're gonna learn something called a front stance. Okay. So, a front stance, we start with our feet shoulder width apart. Uh-huh. We're gonna do our left foot. Okay. Step out one step. Uh-huh. Two step. Oh man. Three step. Oh man. And then a little bit more. Oh my. And we bend our front knee super good. Uh-huh. I'm gonna back up a little bit. Yeah, so we can see. Bend our front go. knee super good. Uh-huh. And our back foot and our back leg is completely straight. Okay. Like so that. From, yep. Okay. And so from here, if we have our punches, boom, 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 boom. boom. Do, do we yell things, Evie? Yes. So a proper yell sounds like this. Key up. You're saying like key up. Key up. Key up. Yeah, like that. Whoa. Key up. Key up. Yep, just like that. Okay. Evie's gonna teach us more of Taekwondo. Here we go, Evie, what do we need? Okay, you're gonna start with your feet shoulder width apart. Okay. And you're gonna make your fist again. Make and then- With the thumbs on the outside. Yes. Okay. Right in front, you're just gonna make a big circle in front of you, basically. Cool. Boom. 
Okay. Is that right? Yeah. Okay. Now we're going to learn something called a high block, which we'll do from this here. So from here, we make our fist again. Our fists, our fists are still there. Uh huh. We put one of them back on our belt. Got it. And then we take this one and we're going to cross to our shoulders. Uh huh. And then up right above our. Yep. And that's high block. So what this does is when somebody is trying to punch you from the top of the head, you go no, and it stops them. No. So you gotta have a so strong. So is it one? Move. Is it one movement? If I'm like this, do I go? Yep. Whoa. Do it all at once. Am I doing it right? Watch me, teacher. Boom. Perfect. Ah, I did it. You're I am so good. No. You're so good. Thank you. Let's do that a few times. So you just go from here, whoop, whoop, and then switch. Whoa. Like that? Mm hmm. Perfect. I feel like I would yell too at this. I, I'd be like, no! <laughs> yeah, it's good. It kind of gets like the energy up when yeah. you yell, you That's know? That's the fun part. Your that adrenaline is. gets. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. Wow. I love how, like, she's, she's so trained with it. It just looks so good. <laughs> yeah. No so, high pitch screaming. So from Joel. here, <laughs> got it. We're gonna go. Yep. Yep. Perfect. Just like that. Okay. Wow. That all that diaphragm training comes in handy for this, huh? <laughs> your big voice. Your belly. You gotta do your big voice, friends. This is not a time to use your quiet voice. It's your big voice. Yeah. Yep. Yep. What I'm about to show you is white belt one step number one. And as I said earlier, we do a lot of sparring, but when you get with your first three belts that you do, we have to teach you something before I can just let you kick and punch people. Because yeah. that's not safe. Yeah. So I'm gonna do one of the first things that you'll learn. Evie, what would you say to really anyone? Because you can start Taekwondo at any age, right? Yep, you can start when you're five years old. Wow, so at for a five-year-old or for a 15-year-old or even for a 50-year-old, what would you say are some of the benefits to doing Taekwondo? I was really clumsy when I was younger, so like it helped with my balance a lot because as you saw earlier, I had to stand on one foot, so you have to get really good balance. You make a lot of really good friends. Like I have a lot of lifelong friends from doing it, which right. is always a good thing. And you get stronger, right? Yep, you get and a lot stronger because we have workouts that we do in between things, workout classes. It uses a lot up a lot of energy, so if you're anxious about something, it's a good way to kind of just let it all go. And it just, it makes me feel safer when I'm out and about. It does, yeah. It's a great self-defense method. You learn a lot, and you learn a lot about culture, too. Yep. Because it's it's a sport that originated from a different country. That was amazing, friends. I'm so excited to finally learn more about Taekwondo. Thank you so much, of Evie. Course. That was wonderful. Can you tell us, again, what your school's name is that you take Taekwondo from? I go to Franklin's Taekwondo. It's in Christiansburg, Virginia. It's behind the courthouse. And so if you have a child that's interested in starting with Taekwondo, learning more about it, they can contact Franklin's. Yeah, Franklin's. you just give them a call. It's phone numbers on the website. And you can try to class. And if you like it, then you sign up and you could get so good at it. Yeah, and you never know. Maybe you'll be a second degree black belt like Evie is. Taekwondo is a Korean martial art. It blends self-defense and combat techniques for both exercise and sport. Taekwondo has been a part of the Olympic Games for over 30 years. Taekwondo literally means the way of the foot and fist. Tai means to destroy with the foot. Kwan means to strike. And Do means path or way. There are six colors of the belts in Taekwondo levels. White, yellow, green, blue, red, and black. Those colors seem familiar. The Olympic flag has a white background with five interlaced rings in the center. Blue, yellow, black, green, and red. The design is symbolic. It represents the five continents of the world united by Olympism. 
while the six colors are those that appear on all the national flags of the world at the present time. 